Nasi bagana or nasi bagana, pronounced as na si bo gana, is an Indonesian style rice dish, originally from Tegal, central Java. It is usually wrapped in banana leaves and served with side dishes. This rice dish is a type of nasi rames or nasi champur terms used for dishes that have rice and a variety of side dishes. Nasi bagana is very popular in Indonesia and is sold all over the streets of Jakarta, the capital city, for 12,000 to 20,000 rupiah each. It is sold in almost all Sundanese or Javanese restaurants and sometimes in warungs or wartegs warung tegel, a traditional outdoor restaurant or café. It is considered a convenient dish as it is wrapped in banana leaves and is usually ready to bring and eat any time. It is a type of fast food that is brought to workplaces to eat. Preparation Nasi bagana is prepared by spreading a wide banana leaf and filling it with steamed rice. Then seasoning such as fried shallots are put on top of the rice. Over the rice, a smaller banana leaf is spread and the side dishes opor ayam white chicken curry, dendeng shredded meat, fried chicken liver and gizzard in chili and coconut gravy, sambal of shredded red chili, teller pindang whole boiled eggs, serendang fried shredded spiced coconut with peanuts, sautéed tempeh or sautéed string beans are decoratively placed. All ingredients are then wrapped and closed with the outer banana leaf that is placed over the rice. Plastic strings are used to tighten the pack together. It is put in a steamer to keep it warm and is ready to eat at any time. Other times they are prepared as a regular rice dish without the banana leaves because the dish has been too common and restaurants do not follow the traditions. Topic: <laughs> Preparation of side dishes. The opor ayam is usually served as pieces without their bones. This is usually done because they can wrap it in banana leaves easier without taking too much space. There are two types of opor ayam, white gravy, commonly used in West Java, and yellow gravy, commonly used in Central Java. Both are sweet but yellow opor ayam tends to have curry spices in it. The dendeng is sometimes put in a stick and eaten the same way as a satay meat in skewer. The teller pindang boiled eggs are most of the time cut in half and only half is served. This depends on the occasion. Serendang, fried chicken liver and gizzard in chili and coconut gravy suggested to use cow livers rather than chicken to avoid the smell, sambal of shredded red chili and sautéed tempeh and sautéed string beans is served regularly, a spoonful of each circling the steamed rice. Tradition and culture In Java, nasi bagana is often used in special occasions, such as weddings and anniversaries, but is most commonly found in family gatherings and social gatherings At weddings, nasi bagana usually has its own booth where people can choose their own side dishes and sauces. Most people prefer nasi bagana to be eaten with karupuk Indonesian flour crackers or emping crushed bean crackers from Malinjo, and as a result it becomes a part of the side dish. Some people like additional sauce like ketchup manis sweet soybean sauce and sambal tarasi fish and shrimp chili sauce. The drink that they have while having this dish is most of the time hot or iced black tea. Topic: <inaudible> Nutrition <inaudible> <inaudible> Nasi bagana contains amounts of protein and carbohydrates from the meat and rice, but also contains a lot of fat and oil since it uses coconut and palm oils in the side dishes. Almost all of the side dishes are prepared by frying. The dish ranges from 1,000 to 1,600 calories per serving. It is comparable with fast food. Topic: <laughs> Similar rice dishes. Nasi champur Nasi gudig Nasi jambling Nasi kapau Nasi kebulai Nasi krau Nasi kuning Nasi langji Nasi lamak Nasi liwit Nasi megono Nasi padang Nasi pasel Nasi timbal Nasi uduk Nasi ulam 